My shirt may say meh on it, but that is not how I feel about this instrument. I have a deep background in music. My dad is a voice teacher and choir director, so I grew up with music constantly in my sphere of things. I played trumpet in middle school and sang through high school and college, and now I play in an ensemble for the instrument I'm about to show you. I picked it up as an impulse purchase at FanimeCon 2011. I don't have the exact one I purchased then, but that was when I purchased my first ocarina. What? I thought the ocarina was only from The Legend of Zelda, the ocarina of time! No, it's not. The ocarina has been around for thousands of years in some way, shape, or form. But the modern version that looks like this has been around since the 1800s in Italy. I won't delve into the history of the ocarina because that's not what you clicked on this video for. <laughs> Instead, I will illustrate how simple it is to pick up and play. I'll be using a plastic 12-hole ocarina made by the company called Noble. This model is called Knight. The first line of the description will be an Amazon link where you can purchase it. This is not the exact same model as the one that I have linked, but they are equally high quality. I recommend the Knight by Noble most out of any plastic ocarina because it has one of the best sound qualities of any plastic instrument I have ever heard. And because it's plastic, it's super durable. So if you drop it, no problem. <laughs> Did I really just yeet my ocarina? <laughs> that was a good bit. It's around $45, which is a little pricey for a plastic ocarina, but you are paying for superb quality. Anyways, now that we've totally simplified your search for an ocarina, let's get to the rest. Most professional quality ocarinas are made from ceramic, and there's even double and triple ocarinas, but if this is your first hour playing the ocarina, don't worry about that at all. You'll learn about these things naturally as you research more. Lots of people firmly believe that they don't have any musical talent, and they're right. Getting good at singing, getting good at an instrument, while talent is a factor in these things, it is largely a skill. It takes practice and learning to get good at it, and anyone can be a good musician if they just try. And because the ocarina is so easy to learn, it is the best gateway instrument. While I did have a musical background before I picked up the ocarina nine years ago, anyone can learn how to do it. It took me about 30 minutes to feel comfortable diddling around on it. <laughs> Diddling. That's not the best word I should be using right there. It took me about 30 minutes to feel comfortable playing on it, but I firmly believe that anybody who has the right resources and the right motivation can learn how to play the ocarina basics in under an hour. Now, how exactly do you do that? Any ocarina that you buy, you could buy the Knight by Noble with the link in the description. <laughs> Any ocarina you buy, will likely have a piece of paper that shows tabs for how to play each note on the instrument. It'll show what holes you need to cover to achieve the sound. I'll put some tabs on the screen here and demonstrate a scale. And with all the sharps and flats now, It can play higher and lower than that, but that gets the basic idea across. It'll take a bit of getting used to, but your fingers will feel comfortable covering all the holes and playing all the notes in no time. Make sure you do cover the holes completely, because otherwise you won't get the right note. And with the ocarina, as with most wind instruments, you do have to breathe harder to play higher notes and breathe more softly to play lower notes. So if I were to blow a low C, that's less air than I play a high C. It's not that much, but it is a difference. Once you feel comfortable playing notes, you don't even need to know how to read sheet music to start playing music. You can figure things out by ear, or just Google ocarina tabs, and you'll find hundreds if not thousands of songs that just use the fingering pattern to illustrate the notes. I will also have some links in the description for useful resources like that if you need an example. So, 
Between learning how to do the fingerings for the instrument, as well as how to breathe into it, with the tabs to actually have songs for you to play, you can literally start playing songs in less than an hour. If you need more resources, I highly recommend the content made by my good friend, David Eric Ramos. He has tons of tutorial resources on his channel, and almost everyone I know who has ever played an ocarina has used them at some point. He also has a comprehensive method book called How to Play the Ocarina. If you Google David Eric Ramos Ocarina book, you'll find sites where you can buy it. It's currently out of stock as of me recording this video, but if it's in stock and you're really looking to get serious with the ocarina, I highly recommend that too. The ocarina is by far one of the easiest instruments to pick up and play, but don't let that make you think that it's not a serious instrument. Just because it's really easy to learn and most well known through The Legend of Zelda does not make it any less valid of a serious instrument. Around the world, there are many professional ocarina players and many ocarina ensembles, especially in Italy, South Korea, Japan, and China. I play in the United States' first ocarina septet called Okabanda, and I would say that it's easily one of the most serious music ensembles I've ever been a part of. Watch our latest video! It's a Deltarune cover arranged by Insane in the Rain Music. <laughs> I will be honest. I'm not the best person to talk to if you want serious ocarina training. I am not the best teacher. But I hope this video has sparked interest in you to buy an ocarina, find resources, and give it a go. It takes serious time and dedication to get to a high level of playing the ocarina or any instrument. But I can guarantee that with one hour of good effort, you'll have a great start with an amazing instrument. Best of luck and see you next time. Quick note at the end of editing this video. The music you've been listening to is by my band Okabanda. I'll include a link in the description where you can buy that EP from our band camp. I really can't believe that I yeeted my ocarina for this. You better subscribe for that. <laughs> for good measure, I will yeet my ocarina one more time if you hit the subscribe button and smash that like button. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ooh.